Hi guys, welcome to Shields Cooking. Today is a new episode of the series Candy Bar to Dessert. A series where I create beautiful and delicious desserts based on the texture and flavor of different candy bars. And today we're going to use a Candy Bueno. We're going to make a whipped hazelnut ganache, a caramelized hazelnut ganache, a chocolate galette and a feuilletina crispy. So if you haven't done already, please subscribe to support my channel and hit that notification button to be sure that you don't miss any amazing cooking videos. So, let's begin. First, let's make the Kinder Bueno filling. For that, toast 90 grams of hazelnuts at 160 degrees Celsius for around 25 minutes. Now transfer them into a blender and also add 40 grams of sunflower oil, 40 grams of hazelnut oil, 50 grams of sugar, and 200 grams of white chocolate. Then cut a vanilla pot in half and scrape out the seeds. Add them to the rest and blender this till it's completely smooth. Then pour it into a bowl covered with plastic foil and let it set in your fridge for at least two hours. After that, Transfer it into a mixer and beat it for around 3 minutes till it's airy and fluffy. Then transfer it into a piping bag. Now for the feuilletina. Pour 20 grams of water into a saucepan together with 10 grams of glucose syrup and 200 grams of sugar. Heat this up till it's a golden brown caramel. Then add 100 grams of hazelnuts and continue cooking it on a low heat till the caramel has a deep brown color. After that pour it on a silicon sheet and let it cool down completely. Then break it into smaller pieces and transfer it into a blender. Also add 25 grams of cocoa powder and blend it into a fine crumble. Now add 30 grams of egg white and continue mixing it till it's completely smooth. Then pour it in a bowl. Now put a round sheet on the silicon mold and spread the mixture on it. The sheets and mold I use in this video are from Mold Products. Find a link to it in the description. Then remove the sheet and bake them at 160 degrees Celsius for 15 minutes. When they're still hot, gently remove them from the mold and directly press it between a ribbon press. Then let it cool down completely and continue baking with in total 5 different sizes. After that, keep them dry and covered for later. Now for the caramelized hazelnut ganache. Mix 20 grams of glucose with 100 grams of sugar and caramelize this on a medium heat. Meanwhile, mix 120 grams of hazelnut liqueur with 40 grams of cream and bring this to a boil. Once the caramel is done, slowly add the hot liquid and give it a good mix. Then turn off the heat and add 120 grams of milk chocolate with 50 grams of butter. Mix this and then emulsify it with a hand blender. Now pour it in a bowl. Then cover it and let it set in your fridge for at least 2 hours. After that put it in a piping bag and keep it in your fridge for later. Then for the chocolate galettes. Take some melted chocolate that's 45 degrees Celsius and add some chocolate nibs to cool the chocolate down till it's 31 degrees Celsius. This process is called tempering. Once that's done, pour it on a plastic sheet and put another plastic sheet on top. Spread the chocolate using a rolling pin and then let it set for 2 minutes. Now cut it with 5 different sizes of round cutters and then let it set for one hour. After that, remove the top layer and gently put the chocolate galettes in a container. Then for the crumble, mix 100 grams of sugar with 80 grams of flour, 
100 grams of butter, 2 grams of flaky salt and 40 grams of melted white chocolate. Knead this till it's a nice dough. Then spread it on a silicon sheet and bake it at 160 degrees Celsius for around 25 minutes till golden. Mix it every 5 minutes with a whisk. Once the crumble is done, transfer it into a blender and also add 60 grams of white chocolate. Mix this till the chocolate is melted. Then pour it on a silicon sheet, put another silicon sheet on top and spread it using a rolling pin. After that let it set in your fridge for 30 minutes. Then remove the top layer and cut it with a small round cutter. Keep the rounds in your fridge for later. And now we can start to plate. First pipe a small dot of the hazelnut cream on the plate and put a feuilletine disc on top. Then continue with the hazelnut cream and the caramel ganache. Now put a chocolate galette on top and continue with the creams. At the fifth layer you can also add a crumble round. Once you've used the biggest disc, you continue building up and taking a smaller round every time. Okay guys, that's it for today. What started out like this turned into this. And I must say I'm pretty pleased with the result. The biggest challenge of this dessert was creating the texture. So the crispiness of the Kinder Bueno and the creaminess of the hazelnut filling. And uh, the creaminess we've accomplished by making the, the airy whipped hazelnut ganache and while the crispiness is in actually all the dessert. So the feuilletine, the, the chocolate galette and the filling. So the, the crumble that we've made with the white chocolate. Um, so yeah, let's dig in. Wow. Yeah, look at all those layers. That's really something. So let's have a little taste to see how it turned out. Yeah. Well, like I said, the hazelnut flavor of the whipped ganache, it's amazing. The, the flavor of the dark caramelized uh, hazelnut ganache it's also really, really nice. Mm. It's a bit chewy because of the crumble. The crumble turned a little bit soft, but in combination with the crispiness of the dark chocolate galette and the feuilletine, that's amazing. So, mm. well, I want to dig in more, but first let's do this. Um, and that's it for today, guys. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Please let me know in the comments on what you want to see next. Like and share the video and subscribe if you want to support my channel and see more amazing cooking videos. And as always, bon appetit!